Greetings, enchanted friends and doll collectors. Welcome back to the Dolls, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, your sanctuary for all things dolls, crafts, and magical tales. Today, we're embarking on a special journey with a doll that not only captures our hearts with her beauty, but also inspires us with her commitment to our planet, Meet Suri Sustainable a blithe doll who lives and breathes the ethos of sustainability. So without further ado, let's meet Suri and discover the wonders she brings from her eco-conscious world. Right from the start, Suri mesmerizes us with her natural colored knits and her outfit that whispers tales of sustainability and care. Her style is a harmonious blend of off-white, green, and navy, with each piece telling a story of eco-friendly fashion. Suri's outfit is a testament to eco-conscious living, blending style with sustainability. Each piece of her ensemble tells a story of mindful fashion and attention to detail. Suri's footwear choice reflects both style and practicality. The light brown boots made of sturdy plastic material mimic the look and feel of genuine leather while ensuring durability and ease of wear. The design cleverly balances aesthetics with functionality as these boots are surprisingly easy to slip on and off. Perhaps one of the most exquisite accessories is her shoulder bag. The bag is a masterpiece of miniature craftsmanship, boasting faux fur on the flap that adds a touch of winter warmth and luxury. The body of the bag is made from hand-stitched leather, presenting an incredible detail that speaks volumes of the doll's quality and the dedication behind her creation. And I'd be also included are vibrant tights featuring bands of tangerine, melon, and olive. They harmonize well with her outfit and the overall color theme of natural and earthy tones. Central to Suri's outfit is her argyle embroidered cable knit vest, a piece that exudes style. The vest is fastened on both sides and creates a cinched look that accentuates her silhouette. Its pattern is meticulously crafted, showcasing the intricate argyle design that remains a timeless fashion statement. Complementing the vest is a matching hat adorned with cable knit ear covers, safeguarding against the chill of winter adventures. Large pom-poms dangle playfully from the tips of the earpieces and the top of the hat, adding a whimsical flair. And as we unpack all of the plastic on Suri's head, we unveil her long, dark brown hair, embodying the classic blithe trait of a slightly greasy, tacky texture. I don't dare to think about what I would have been without them. While it's a common feature among Blythe dolls, requiring a bit of extra love and care, Suri's mane appears somewhat more manageable than others. The tangles and snarls present are not as daunting, promising a smoother process to comb out and restore her hair to its intended glory. It's a reminder of the patience and attention to detail that caring for these dolls, and by extension our environment, often requires. Suri's face type is Radiance Evolution, with a latte face color that radiates warmth and a healthy glow. Her makeup, a blend of olive green eyeshadow, orange blush, and salmon pink lips, complements her tanned skin beautifully. And her eyes, they're a captivating mix of brown, blue, light green, and orange, reflecting the colors of the earth. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out 
we continue our unboxing, we encounter the usual packaging that Blythe dolls are known for. Suri arrives carefully wrapped in plastic. It's a desire to protect her during her journey. I get that. And while the plastic serves its purpose, it presents a delicate moment of care as we remove it, ensuring that no harm comes to Surrey in the process. The packaging, though a hurdle, underscores the value and preciousness of what it protects. Jumping from cliffs so high, trusting our wings to fly. As we dress Suri, we face the charming challenge of fitting her with her striped tights. The task is somewhat tedious, attributed to her small rubbery legs that, while adorable, don't make the process any easier. Yet this step is crucial, not just for completing her look, but also for protecting her from any potential color transfer from her navy shorts. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my high. The shorts pair wonderfully with her dress, a piece that's lauded for its perfection and design and fit. The dress, with its green hues and thoughtful fabric choice, accentuates Suri's connection to nature and her sustainable lifestyle, reinforcing the narrative of eco-conscious living through fashion. Each piece of Surrey Sustainables outfit, from her hair down to her boots, tells a part of her story, reflecting a commitment to a lifestyle that values the environment, craftsmanship, and thoughtful consumption. We're reminded of the beauty and responsibility of nurturing and preserving both our collectibles and our planet. Now let me address the massive cognitive dissonance that's quite literally sitting in front of us. Here we have Suri, a doll that embodies the spirit of sustainability through her story and accessories, crafted to inspire us towards a greener, more conscious lifestyle. And yet there's an elephant in the room we can't ignore. Suri is made of plastic, a material known for its environmental impact and she's been shipped all the way from Japan, adding to her carbon footprint. It's a paradox that's hard to overlook, especially for those of us passionate about reducing our ecological footprint and advocating for sustainable living. This brings us to a crossroads of sorts, doesn't it? I mean, on one hand, Surrey is a beacon of sustainability, promoting eco-friendly practices and the joy of crafting and growing. On the other hand, her very existence as a plastic product and the logistics involved in bringing her to us pose questions about sustainability and the choices we make. But maybe this isn't just a contradiction. Maybe it's a conversation starter, a way to open dialogue about the complexities of living sustainably in a world that's not quite there yet. It's about recognizing the challenges we face as we strive for a greener planet while navigating the realities of our current systems and infrastructures. Let Surrey be a reminder that the journey towards sustainability is filled with learning, growing, and sometimes reconciling with the imperfect steps we take along the way. It's about progress, not perfection. And each choice we make towards a more sustainable lifestyle is a step in the right direction. But it's hard to see it clear. Let's explore how we can embrace sustainability in our lives, even when faced with contradictions, and how we can make conscious choices that lead us closer to the future we dream of for our planet. Thank you so much for joining me in this important discussion. Your thoughts and actions matter, and together we can make a difference. If you enjoyed this video, I'd love it if you would subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye. I ain't got nothing